Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Guys, everybody's back from summer vacations and have been coming in requesting new strings with different strings and new rackets, but they're not happy with it. Why? Stay tuned. All right, guys, coffee sponsor of today is Kevin. Kevin writes, thanks for teaching me how to string, not to mention all the, um, the other amazing info. Oh, thank you, Kevin. I appreciate the coffee. I appreciate the praise. Um, thank you so much. If you want to be my coffee sponsor of the day, network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. Thank you all for keeping the Java train rolling. I appreciate you. Let me... It's vine and walnut. It's a medium roast. Probably shouldn't have chose that. But I'm not a big major Dickinson fan. So, and there was no Sumatra today. Um, yeah, medium roast. Okay. Needed to be a little darker. Um, okay, so... Uh, people have been coming back from summer break, and girl season is is kind of getting getting going. Uh, a lot of people have come back and said, "Oh, my pro said I should switch rackets," or "My pro said I should switch strings." So we've been, you know, going gangbusters out here at the at the shop, uh, selling a lot of rackets, restringing a lot of uh, strings. And they're using polys or hybrids in which they've never used before. So um, selling a lot of, you know, confidential, selling a lot of RPM, ALU, uh, straight up or in blends. And I'm looking at them like, okay. I was like, you know what you're doing, right? And they're like, yeah, I tried it, tried my pros racket over the summer and it was great. I'm like, okay, that's fine as long as you've tried it before. So we get it done and like within a day, literally within a day, um, 20%, well, maybe more than that actually, like, like 30 to 40% of the people are literally coming back to the shop and saying, I, I don't like this. I'm like, but you asked for it. And you said you tried it. And they're like, uh, yeah, but it's not what I expected. It's not what I felt uh, with my pros racket. I was like, okay, well, where were you? Like, oh, I was in Europe. Or I was back east. And I'm, I'm going to look behind me here. Yeah. The West Coast has different weather <laughs> it's kind of cooling down today i mean it was good weather the last couple weeks but weather has something to do with it um wear has something to do with the strings so when it's hot your strings are lively when it gets used your strings are looser so you kind of get a comfortable string that's kind of lively uh if you're like in the hot european heat or the sunny, sunny side of the Hamptons, uh, or Nantucket, you know, it, it's going to have a different feel. The surface might be different. The air is definitely different. When you come back here and you get a freshly strung racket that's like either a straight poly or a hybrid with a poly in it, it's going to feel tight and it's going to feel harsher. Uh, so these people are actually coming right back to me and switching right back to what they had, which was a, a multi or, or a gut. And I was like, are you sure you want to do this? You haven't really gave it a chance yet. And they're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't, I can't use that. I can't use that. So obviously I try to talk them out of it, but the reason I'm making this video is because I'm not able to. <laughs> so, so that's why I want to tell everybody out there who I can't be in front of. Um, 
give it a chance. Give it a chance. You can't literally play with it for an hour or two hours and expect magic. I mean, what you played with was in certain conditions, it's been used, therefore it has a certain feel. You didn't allow your string to get into that feel zone yet. Uh, you gave it literally the hardest, tightest time to test it out, and that's all you gave it. So what I'm telling you guys to do is give it a chance. Give it a chance. Try to get used to it a little bit more. Um, three, four times out, let, let's, let's give it at least that. Uh, I mean, I was thinking about this last night because I've been dealing with this for the last two weeks. Think about it this way, guys. Who likes beer out there, right? Who likes wine out there? Who likes alcohol out there? Who likes coffee out there, right? Now, think about it this way. Did you like it when you first tried it? Or did you have to get an acquired taste for it? Right. I, I mean, I didn't like coffee when I first tried it. I thought it was like the nastiest thing out there. When I tried beer, I'm like, who the heck drinks this? You know, and, and wine. I mean, this ain't grape juice. You know, grape juice tastes better. Give me Welch's any day. Right. When I was like 21, 18, whatever it was. I don't know. It doesn't matter. You know, but I mean, think about it that way. You didn't like that stuff when you were younger. But you gave it a chance, and now, what? You can't live without it, right? <laughs> you know? So, and you developed a taste for it, and you got used to it, and now it's part of your life, right? Let's make those strings, you know, let's get acquainted with those strings a little bit more so that you can have it be maybe a part of your life and maybe enhance your tennis a little bit more. Right. And I'm seeing this you like in strings especially, but I'm also seeing it in rackets too. Literally, people are buying new rackets and they're like, this doesn't feel like my old one. I was like, yeah, because you had your old one for 50 years. It's soft. This is stiff. Right. And they're literally going right back to the old rackets. Guys, give it a chance. Let it break in a bit. Um, you know, don't just discount it or discontinue it from your uh, usage before it's time. You know, like, like wine, you got sometimes the good stuff, you pop the cork and you put it in that little thing that lets it aerate. Yeah. Rackets kind of need the same thing. It needs to be aerated. It needs to be used. It needs to be broken in. Right. And then it develops and then you get the nice aromas, the nice, tannins right and then you shake it up and then you look at it for no reason you know and then then you you smell it and then you drink it right is it good well it definitely can be just like your tennis racket okay guys give it a chance thank you for watching tennis spin where we put our spin on your tennis Out. The ball was in. You cannot be serious. You cannot be serious. The ball hit the paint. Paint flew up. Did you not see that? Are you blind? You need an eye doctor. You cannot be serious. Oh, wait. I have swing vision. The ball is in.